Alex Faust, Nick Baugh here with you. Really from the outset of game, the Creighton dominated on the glass, and that, that really got their offense jump-started. There's no doubt. Creighton's ability to control the paint and control the glass set the tone for the whole game. I thought it broke the spirit of Western Illinois. You could never quite get on track. Foul trouble loomed large for them. But it was Jeffrey Grissell who really put his fingerprints on the game uh, in, in really every way imaginable. It started with getting him a touch on a double back screen to get him to the post and working to his left hand for a jump hook. He was so active all game long, both offensively, there you see defensively. And then the highlight of the night, the right-handed tip dunk for a left-handed player. He was just tremendous all game long in making life difficult for Western Illinois guards when they got into the paint and then just found little creases on the picks and rolls for him to be able to get into the teeth of the defense to be able to score. And then the freshman Kyrie Thomas I thought was tremendous in the second half. His activity level on the defensive end of the floor spilled over into his productivity on the offensive end of the floor. Leak out, little great outlet pass for Jeffrey Gassell and Kyrie Thomas lays it in. He finishes with 18 points and so Alex, you, you look at Creighton and you think about who do we need to stop if you're playing them. And you don't necessarily think Grissel and Kyrie Thomas are two guys that come to mind, but those guys combined for 18 points and 17 points. You wonder where Creighton, we, we talked about their depth, and they've got so many scores at their, disposable, at, at their disposal, and they scored in different ways tonight as well. Yeah, and, and they're going to have to find different ways because you can't be too predictable. You can't just live and die by the three. You have to find ways to get early offense and transition or throw it into the post or get to the free throw line. And they did all those things tonight. That's why you saw 97 points from the Blue Jays. Creighton at 5-1 and one on the season after a dominant win here at home.